Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of day it is where you are. I hope it's a good day. It's a good day for me. Woke up this morning. Old folks used to say, clothed in my right mind and the full activities of my limbs. So, yeah, it's a good day. Starting a new job today. Yeah, had a decision to make last week. I was offered... You can um, either be terminated or you can resign. It was okay. I resigned. Uh, not that that really made any difference. See, the thing of it is, is when you call people out for what they are, they don't like it. And then when you take it to the higher-ups and, and, and announce it, document it and everything else, they really don't like that. So it's uh, it can be a problem. You know, it can be a problem. But that's okay. I'm used to being a problem child. It's all right. I like stirring the pot. See, the thing of it is, is at this stage of my journey, I am too old to play politics. I don't like politics. I don't like games. You know, be straight up. Be what you are. Call it like it is. You know, you don't have to be rude or hurtful to anybody. But, I mean, if you're, a, if you're a bigot or a racist or whatever it is that you title that you like to claim yourself as being and you're a passive-aggressive one at that, you know, just own up to your shit. You're an asshole. Plain and simple. I do not appreciate people who like to cloak their wickedness. I don't like people who do that. You are what you are. And you are seen for what you are. Somebody going to call you out. And then you're going to be pissed off about it. Oh, well. You know. But for me, it was just. uh, I really think my purpose in being there was to bring attention to the BS that was going on. And this is a highly reputable medical facility. Okay. But they've got people there. I'm sure there are other professionals, but for the ones that I had to deal with, these are what I refer to as academics. And not all of them are butt wipes, but you have those who think more highly of themselves than they ought. And they they can't speak to nobody, you know. They don't talk to you until they want something. You know, it's like, come on, come on. You know, quit, quit the games, quit the games. You don't like me because of what? Because I won't kiss your ass? I'm sorry. <clears throat> but ass kissing is not on my resume. Um, y'all might have had it in the fine print on for the job description, but I didn't see it. And had I seen it, I definitely would not have applied for the position. Nevertheless, I don't do but. I don't... Don't do that, you know. I have noticed a higher degree of people who really want to make an issue. Really want to make an issue. Out of having folks bow down to them. Who are you, old man? You put on your drawers just like anybody else. Just because you have 9, 12, 15 degrees, you know, behind your name means nothing other than you are an intellectual asshole. You have no people skills. And the ones you have, it's a front. Like I said, folks don't like it when you call them out for what they are. Hey, stop being that then. Your feelings get hurt. You're so damn sensitive, you know. Stop being the asshole. Don't do that. It's not a cool thing to do. I'm just saying. (laughs) I uh, have some former uh, co-workers who also were fired from their jobs here just about a week or so ago. As usual, it's the politics that go on, you know. It needs to stop. Yeah, there are plenty of jobs out here. There's some decent jobs. Or I should say employment. There's a decent employment. The problem is 
the people that you are employed by or who have these positions open. They either don't want to pay you any money and treat you like shit, or they want to pay you a little bit of money and still treat you like shit. Neither one of those are working. That's why many places are a revolving door. And I think some of them like it like that because they can constantly get people in for little or no money and, uh, you know, just abuse and misuse them, especially young people. Another thing that I've noticed is um, for those of you out here who may be uh, clerical uh, uh, workers, office administration, things like that. What's up with this have to have a bachelor's degree to answer a freaking phone? I've seen more jobs that are requiring uh, asking for receptionists, but she has to have a BA. A BA in what? We don't care. You just have to have a bachelor's degree to answer a damn phone? Are you kidding me? See, that's the shit I'm talking about. It's a game. It's all a game. So I would say this. If you can do for yourself, if you can, if you have the entrepreneurial spirit, hustle for yourself, do that. By all means, do that. Whatever gifts and talents and visions that you may have, implement those. Put them into action. Don't sit on it. Don't let nobody talk you out of it. Do you. We all don't have to be employed by others, especially these corporations. Especially these corporations. They're assholes, each and every one of them. Anyway, that's my rant for today. You have a good one. Mine is good. Like I said, I woke up this morning. Clothed in my right mind and the full activities of my limbs. I'm high today. I, I'm high on the spirit of life and the spirit of discernment and wisdom that are within me. It's in you too. Tap in, tune up, surf that wave. It's MA True. Out.